Hello everyone, my name is Python GB and welcome back to another episode of my Terraria Summoner playthrough. We're on the ninth episode, my friends. Thank you so much for the amount of support you've been showing. Once again, you know, we're reaching around a thousand likes per episode, which is amazing, guys. It really is very amazing. So if we can keep that kind of support up, that would be so highly appreciated. You have no idea. But anyways, guys, we're actually going to start off this episode by going ahead and trying to find some Skylands, because we haven't really done that yet. So, boom. We've only got one grab potion to our name, but goddammit, we're still going to give this a really good shot. We're going to see if we can't find ourselves. Whoa, holy mother of poop. There's one right above our house. That's amazing! I've never had a Skyland right above my house before, man. That's freaking sweet, dude. Alright, what do we got? Star Fury, you're not allowed to use it. God damn it, that kind of sucks. Alright, so let's go ahead and just keep going, my friends. We're not really, uh... Uh, I, I kind of want to go ahead... I'm doing this for a specific reason. Uh, uh... What am I doing? What am I doing? No, 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 no. My movement is, like, jacked up at the moment. Uh, so I'm upside down at the moment, so that's the right way. Well, what I want to do is I want to get some speed while I'm flying along. Like I said, there we go. Right, now I'll do the whole going up and down thing. Because otherwise I'll be going really, really slow in the air. And as a result of that, I won't really be able to get anywhere. You know what I'm saying? So, something like that. But anyways, guys, yeah, let's go ahead and keep exploring. Uh, hmm. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. I feel like exploring to the left-hand side might actually be a better idea at this point. Because, oh. Wait, oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, ah, ah, I found another one! Wait, alright, cool. What you got? Uh, it's a balloon! It's a balloon. Awesome stuff. Alright, uh, explore the left-hand side. Let's do it. Alright, we're going up the left-hand side, my friends. For the reason of there's not a lot of space left on the right-hand side of the map to really explore. So, yeah, let's go ahead and explore up here. I do apologize because you guys probably can't even see where I'm flying to, to be honest. So... Yeah, but I can't do a great deal about that. The nighttime in Terraria is rather dark, so that is a thing you have to contend with, really. <laughs> Alright, come on. Come on. Island. Give us another island. Maybe with a horseshoe on it. I want a horseshoe. You're awesome. And uh, horseshoe. I guess the balloon would be kind of cool in the dungeon, maybe, to try and avoid people's attacks, you know, jump higher. Kind of cool, I guess. Uh... Anything, anything at all. Got like 50 seconds left of grab potion. We've got to keep going. There we go, Budski. And a couple of stars for our trouble as well. All right, and yeah, there we go. It's a good old horseshoe. Awesome, 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 awesome. I mean, we might as well. We've only got like, what, 30 seconds left. We can have a bit of a look-see around, see if there's anything more. I don't think there is. Although I could be mistaken. We might find a sky lake or something. I'm pretty sure, although I don't know if it's correct, I don't know. I'm pretty sure at least one Sky Lake spawns on every world. Come on, let that be the case. Eh, there we go. I thought so. I thought as much. We got ourselves a Sky Lake, ladies and gentlemen. Awesome stuff. All right, and that's pretty much the final island we're probably going to find on this world. Nice. I like it. I dig it. I dig it. Got some cool stuff out of that. Awesome. Okay, so Horseshoe probably won't need that, although I don't know put that on actually <laughs> just for the sake of safety i guess and stuff yeah all right what else have we got we've got swiftness potions shine potions uh i'm gonna take the shine potions with me because why not we'll have the endurance potions as well uh we've got bombs pool and a bunch of other crap really yeah all right i think it's time to go ahead and organize our inventory and i'll be back in just a moment well, the dryad has arrived, but she's gonna... Yeah, I thought so. She'd be way up there. <laughs> God damn it. I right, uh, tell you what, actually, while it's raining, I could go ahead and de-equip some of these guys. I am going to relocate the witch doctor. All right, you can bugger off, and I'm gonna go ahead and put the dryad in there. Okay, so if we just walk away now, because it's, uh, because it's, you know, raining, she should spawn in there. And there, yes, yeah, she has, but she's, like, right in front of the blooming witch doctor. <laughs> Oh dear. Uh, die trader! I don't really think you're going to be all too useful, but I don't know. I could be wrong, of course. Alright, so we are going to go ahead and kick the Burn of Cthulhu's butt a couple of times, and then we're going to head to the dungeon to explore it. So yeah, let's go and get on with this. Alrighty, guys, let's get this thing rolling, shall we? So moving down here, obviously, you know, because we've got the horseshoe on, we don't have to worry about full damage, in fact, at all. So that's kind of awesome. So, do 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 do. Wow, I'm just looking at the weather meter there. 53 mile an hour winds. Holy poop sack, man. Quite, that's quite heavy, isn't it? 
Oh dear, oh dear. Right, now, the question is, are we going to find any hearts down here or no? Clothia has arrived. Uh, I guess that's cool. Wow, this is uh, some jacked up generation right here. Holy poop. All right, come on. Uh, yep, yeah, that's looking good. I just don't have any hearts. So, yeah, I mean, let's go ahead and keep exploring. Who knows? We could get lucky. We could get lucky. There's still time yet. <laughs> All right, uh, down here. All right, this is a... This is a big area, isn't it? Holy crap. Okay, so there's, what, one, two, three, four, five, so far, six. So that's another two Brand of Cthulhu fights, and thus, you know, quite a heck of a lot of uh, Demonite, or Crimtain, more to the point. Hmm. Okay, anything over this way? Uh, no, it goes... Wow, it goes straight into an underground snow biome? That's kind of cool. You don't see that very often. Huh. That really isn't something you see very often. It's kind of cool. I like that. <laughs> Just go straight into a different biome. Nice. Who knows? There might even be hearts up here. You never know until you try, right? Uh, nothing up there. Just a bunch of gold. Uh, no, basically. Oh, no, and a light. And there is a heart right there. <laughs> okay, cool. 300 health is now the amount we have. Could we find the other five hearts in like one go? That'd be amazing. I mean, let's be honest, it's not going to happen, is it? <laughs> uh, we're right beside the surface too, so I think that was just a lucky find that heart, to be honest. Uh, there's a shield statue down there. Not entirely sure what that uh, trap was connected to, but oh well, not uh, not too fussed about it. All right, let's go. Let's go. Uh, let's go kick the Brenny Cthulhu's butt. Alrighty, guys, it is time. Right, here we go, and here we go. Crimson Heart has just been obtained, which I guess is kind of cool. Oh, there we Oh, what the hell, man? You have to spawn right there, don't you? Oh, God damn it. All right, yep, we're okay. And buff. Yep, all right, buffs are already good. So, yeah, let's just let's just take this guy down <laughs> and stuff. Get wrecked, son! Yeah, he just got done taken down and, and stuff. All right, so now we just got one more to take down, I guess. And that's pretty much it in terms of the ones we can take down via hearts. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get this thing done. Time has come. All right, buddy. Y'all are going to get killed. Oh, what the hell, Medusa? Why would you have to come in here, man? What the heck? Girl, like, full on comes. Oh, she might actually kill me if I'm not careful. Oh, she's going to like. Oh, no, 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 Kill her! Kill her! Please kill her! Please kill her! Are, are you like actually not? Yeah, that. No, yeah, um. It's just why? There was no sign of a marble biome nearby. Why the hell was there a Medusa? Man, that's just a bunch of crap. The hell, man? I ain't happy with that. Well, look at the amount of crimson rods we got. <laughs> yeah. Hey, this one does more damage. Oh, hey, what the hell? I'm going to take this one. I don't know why it's only... That's got blue text. That's only got white text. Huh. Oh, well. I'll take the one that does more damage, please. And thank you. Yeah. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right. And yeah, we just got a bunch of stuff here. Uh, light pet. Nice one. All right. And yeah, let's just go and just quick stack some stuff. 71 gold pre-hard mode. That's pretty decent in my opinion. All right. And just got a bunch of this other stuff too. Nice one. And vertebrae, uh, of course, goes in the potion ingredients chest. All right, cool. Man, I can't believe a Medusa came over the van and just kicked our ass like that. That's just a bunch of crap. I don't like it. <laughs> uh, oh, well. Right, I'm going to go buy some torches, and then we're going to explore the dungeon. But we're not going to explore the whole dungeon, okay? Because we just don't need to. We flat out don't need to. The only thing we might want to try and find is A, a cobalt shield, and B, the frost chest. Both of those things are needed for our summoner playthrough, but everything else, like the Mura Master and everything like that, just don't need it. Flat out don't need it, so we're not going to go and grab them. But obviously, you know, we'll have to keep searching through the chests until we do find the Cobalt Shield. So, yeah. Aside from that, that's all we're looking for. We're looking for the Cobalt Shield and the Frozen Chest. See you guys. I'll meet you guys at the dungeon. Alrighty guys, the time has come. Let's do this thing. We're going to pick up the water candles as we go along. 
And other, th other things we don't really need. We don't need the water bolt, so there's not even any point in looking for it. So we're just going to go ahead and surge through this place. That really is all we can do. I mean, we don't need to look for things we don't need to, so yeah, we're not going to do it. All right, so... Do, 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 do. We need to find uh, dungeon slimes and all regular chests. Oh, and some of these. Yeah, alchemy table, man. I'll take that. We can sweet, man. I like me an alchemy table. Bewitching table is another thing I wouldn't mind trying to find. Uh, oh, there we go. First couple of locked chests right there. Yay. Uh, Alright, that's what I forgot. You can go ahead and get keys from these uh, from these vases here too. So, get some of them. And that'll be awesome. Yay. So, oh my lord. There's not a lot of guys there or anything. I saw a mechanic right there. Oh, mechanic! Hey, mechanic! How you doing, Butchki? Uh, you you go and jack a house or something. That's what you guys do, isn't it? <laughs> you jack all my houses, you bunch of butts. All right, boom, boom. Yeah. All right, guys. Uh, let's go ahead and see if we can't find some keys, and then we shall begin opening some chests in an attempt to look for the Cobalt Shield. So, yeah. Back shortly. You know what I'm also going to do, guys? I'm actually going to start dismantling some of this wire because I feel like I should be going ahead and doing so. The reason being is because I want to maybe set up some teleporters later down the line, you know? And I feel like this is the good way to do it, you know? You don't even have to buy anything this way. So, yeah. I'm just trying to think ahead. I'm just trying to think ahead. Uh, what's that? That is the uh, that is the hallowed chest. Not exactly useful to our cause, but... Oh, nonetheless... There's our first bewitching table and a tally counter, apparently. Awesome. I'll take it. No! Oh! oh, and there has to be a key slime right there. Why you do this, Terraria? You butt. Alrighty, guys. Our first gold chest. What's it going to be? It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a shadow key. Okay, that's okay, actually. I'm okay with that. Because then we can open shadow chests in the, in the hell regions and stuff. So, yeah. I can deal with it. I like it. Do, 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 do. Now, if you lot could start, like, dropping keys or something, that'd be great. Oh, fantastic. One actually did drop as well. Good stuff. All right, so, uh, mappy, map, map, mappy. Uh, God, ah, there's too much stuff going on. I can't stop. I literally can't stop. All right, look at that. Bone wand. Awesome. All right, what you're going to give me, Budski? It's going to be a magic missile. Not useful to our cause. Ooh, time to run. Time to run. Ooh, God damn it. Uh, uh, yeah, use that. Use it. Go, go, go. All right, all right. And let's get the waspies down here. Go. Uh, waspie. Boom. Oh, what? Don't curse me, you blooming stupid blooming things. You're, you're things. That's what you are. That's the greatest insult ever. You're a thing. <laughs> all right. Oh, God damn it. I'm a skeleton. You see, these wooden platforms... Well, they're not wooden platforms. These platforms are the things that really sort of put you off your stride, you know? Because you feel like you're going to fall down, but no, no, you're not. You're really not. So, yeah. All right. Any sign of any more keys? This is the question. Is I need some. I really need some. Oh, talking of which. Check it out. Hey. Go on. Can you, like, stop trying to run away and, like, fight me like a man, please? Uh, there we go. Fantastic. Thank you very much, buddy. All right. Uh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, okay, okay, uh, yeah, yeah, okay, all right, I understand, you want to kill me, just please, like, bugger off or something. Oh, perfect, there it is, the, uh, the blooming cobalt shield, we found it, awesome, okay, so all we need to do now, literally all we need to do now is try and find the frozen chest, just so we have some sort of references to where it is. Uh, in the meantime, let's go ahead and use your crimson rod, take these suckers down, here you go, buddy, thank you very much indeedy, all right, let's, uh, let's, let's keep going, my friends. Whoa! Check it out! It's biome chest heaven up in there. There's like two biome chests right, like, like right next to each other. Boom! Why not, man? I'll take it. Uh, nice. Uh, right now, if all these guys can like bugger off or something, then I might actually be able to go and get some stuff done. In other words, marking out where these things are. Uh, I don't know. I don't need that one. Hey, hey do you do you mind, sir? Do, hey, hey, do you mind, sir? Hey, I'm trying to. I'm trying. Thanks. Thanks. No, I, I'm only trying to put some torches down. That's absolutely fine and dandy to keep keep blowing hitting me. Argh, yeah, I'm getting out of here, man. <sighs> man, that's a stressful place, that is. Holy crap. Right, okay, so, uh, what do we get in terms of accessories? We've got ourselves a cobalt shield, and that's about it. In fact, I, no, it's not. We've got ourselves a couple cal tally counters, haven't we? Yeah, there we go. Nice. I'm going to put that right there. Awesome. All right, anything up here that I can put down? Yep, apparently there is. And the rest of it is all pretty much decor and stuff we've already got. So let's go and do this. And yeah, 
Man, we've done well. We've done well, my friends. We've done well. Look at all the stuff that we need to sell, though. Can you imagine how much gold we're going to get from it all? Holy poop. Anyways, guys, on that note, it is time to end the episode. I apologize if it's been a shorter one than normal, but, you know, like I keep saying, you know, sometimes I can walk off for hours on end and it winds up being like a 10 minute episode or something. It's kind of crazy. But yeah, guys, it is time to end it. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy the episode and, of course, you're excited to see more, be sure to drop a like rating. And, of course, you guys can subscribe if you want to know when the future videos are out. But yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. In the next episode, uh, we're going we're gonna to do the old hell trip. We're going to go to hell. You're literally going to go to hell. So, yeah. It's going to be cool. We're going to have ourselves some fat imp dudes, basically. It's about damn time, isn't it? <laughs> fat imp dudes, man. I love them, man. I love the fat imp dudes. They're amazing. They're brilliant dudes. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching again. Your support has been much appreciated. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.